Okay, uh, this is going to be a pretty quick tip, and this is just going to be how to change your IP address for free. Okay, you don't need any, um, you know, $12 a month service like HMA Pro or anything like that to do this. Uh, this is actually ch going into your router and actually changing the IP address. So if you don't have Windows 8, you know, you go in um, Windows 7 and you just uh, go into the start menu. You're going to type in uh, CMD. Basically, you get your command prop up. When this uh, comes up, you're going to type in um, IP config, and you're going to scroll up until you find uh, something that says default gateway. Take that number that you see there, the uh, 192.168.2.1, or if you have a Belkin router, this is what you're going to have. If you have another router, just get that number, okay? So then what you're going to do is you're going to come over to your browser. I just always go into this for, uh, it's just a habit. So 192.168.2.1. And when you come into this, what you're going to actually have to do is come over here to a MAC address because in order to change your IP, you need to actually change the MAC address because this is what Craigslist is actually reading uh, when they look at this. Now, if you've never created a, a login pin or anything like that, you're just going to hit submit, meaning if you've never came into this before and you wanted to change it. All you're going to do is change this last number. You can change it up or down any way you want. Now, I'm not going to do it because I just did it. As you can see, my original was 93, and then I changed it to 92. I've changed it to 91, which is what it's sitting at right now. Um, once you do that, it's going to give you a 40-second timer. After that 40-second timer um, runs out, go unplug your modem and unplug your uh, router and wait another 40 seconds and then plug both of those back in. And then when you uh, come back online, you'll have a brand new IP address. It's literally that simple. And, you know, I hope uh, this was helpful for you. I know this is a, a pretty good best kept secret for especially internet marketers who uh, market on Craigslist. Uh, they, they wouldn't want you knowing this type of thing. They'd charge you an arm and a leg for it. Uh, another thing you can do is while you're chessing it, um, When, you're, uh, when you are testing it, I always wonder what is my IP address and I look at what my current IP address is and I actually keep this um, I'll keep this page up while I'm going into the um, the Perhaps I said it wrong. Uh, 198. Point, um, uh, I forget what it is already. There it is. Alright, so when I come in here and I actually go and change this, uh, after everything's set, after this 40 second timer is done, and after my IP address, and uh, I mean, after my router and um, modem have been disconnected and uh, Replugged in, I give it a minute and then I actually refresh this page, and you'll actually see your IP address change right before your eyes. Okay, so that's how you can check that uh, your IP address is actually changed. Okay, so that's the end of this. I told you it would be quick. Uh, I hope this was helpful for you guys, and I'll uh, see you in the next video. See you.